Hi guys. So, um, today I'm back with a makeup tutorial. I'm going to try to get in the groove of things again. I'm doing three videos a week. Um, yeah, I think I said that in my last video, but we'll see, right? Um, so anyways, I just decided to do a simple, actually it's not even simple. I don't even know what I'm saying. Um, okay, so usually when I go to record, sometimes I might have something in mind that I'm going to do, but I really don't know until I sit down and then start playing around. So today I was like, well, I want to do something different than I've done in a while. I've done a lot of neutral looks and kind of like um, everyday makeup looks, so I decided to kind of like spruce things up a little bit and go with a purple type of smoky eye. Um, so anyways, I'm trying not to make my intros long, so if you guys want to see how I got this look, please continue to watch and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye! So I'm going to first go in with the primer and then I'm going to take a flat brush and go in with this super pretty color from um, MAC. It's like a purple type of like holographic color is super pretty I will put everything below of what it is I'm just gonna go in and pat that all over the lid once that's patted all all over the lid I'm gonna go in with this deeper purple color and it's matte so I'm just gonna go in with that with a crease brush from Sigma and put that all over into the crease and I'm just gonna make sure that I'm blending it out very well once that's all over the crease I'm gonna go in with this shimmer darker purple color just to go on the outside of the lid just to add a little bit more definition Moving on for the highlight, as usual, I'm going to be using Beauty Call, Booty Call from the Urban Decay Naked 2 palette. It's a super pretty highlight, simple. I'm just going to put this underneath the eyebrow and to the inner corner of the eye to brighten up the eye some more. Alright, so for the lower lash line, I'm going to go in with that second deep purple that I used and just line the bottom of the lash line with it. And I think I kind of mixed it with um, the, uh, the third purple that I used just a little bit, but just put that on the lower lash light and blend out. After that, I'm going to go in with the super pretty liner from NYX. It is... Um, I, I mean it is liner but I just decided to put it on my lid it just kind of added a little bit of pop to the eye and kind of made the purple stand out a little bit more since it is kind of more matte I just thought this would you know make it less dull As you can see, the, the liner definitely glammed it up. Um, I had no problems with it on the top, so it worked really great on the lid as well. I'm going to go in with Kat Von D Tattoo Liner, my favorite eyeliner at the moment right now and has been for a couple of months. If you have not tried it, I suggest you try it out. It is amazing. So I'm just going to go in on the top with the wing and that will be it for the liner. <laughs> So I did just apply false eyelashes and I am now applying Better Than Sex by Too Faced Mascara. It's a great mascara. This is actually just a little sample size that I got from Sephora. I would try it out. Also, if you guys are in for a new mascara. So I'm going to go in now with the Rihanna Hearts MAC. I guess it's like a blush and bronzer duo. I'm just going to put this all over my cheeks and around the temple area. 
I'm going to then line my lips with this Nude by Sephora. These pencils are only $5 and they work amazing. I'm then going to go in with, with Whisper by Maybelline. It's a super pretty nude color. And then that is the completed look. And I want to thank you guys so much for watching. And please stay tuned for my next video. Bye.